It's March, and we are at UOP witnessing Delta's beach volleyball team face Sacramento City and Sierra. We asked Coach Hummel and a few players about the game and the season so far. We're just out here. We want to get better every day and compete at a high level. Um, the girls are they're doing a good job, and, and a lot of them have never played before, so the expectation is really just to keep getting better and learn the game and, and grow individually and together as a team. I just think we're working on getting better and just um, like learning the sport and trying to create like a bond between the team for indoor. I asked Coach Hummel and Emily about the differences in beach volleyball and regular volleyball and how they use beach volleyball to help with regular volleyball during the season. So lots of differences. So in beach volleyball, we play with two players on the court versus six players on the court. We have five teams of two. And we also, um, there's a lot of different rules. So um, it's, it's a big difference between the indoor game versus beach. So learning, a lot of our, all of our girls played indoor that are playing beach. So they've had to learn the beach game. So we've been utilizing beach to help keep us in shape and training year round and competing at a high level year round to really help their indoor game. However, we do have some athletes that are interested in moving on for beach specifically. Um, and so it's, it's great because it allows them to have more opportunities to transfer to the four year schools. Uh, yeah, it definitely, I have also been practicing indoor like while in the beach season. And I have, I feel like my shots from hitting front row like I feel like I have more shots from beach and I also might be jumping a little higher so we'll see. Well there you go that's the differences between beach volleyball and volleyball. I'm Alan Taloyo from DCTV News. Bye!